Hey guys, welcome to a new tutorial from the power of Excel. Following the big numbers, uh, the big number of requests uh, in order to continue this series, uh, we will do today uh, another functionality um, that will uh, help us to edit the data from our uh, from our tool. Uh, for example, here if we click uh, show data, we see that in the table we have uh, many lines and uh, the request was that uh, if you select a line and you have a button here edit data a new form to be opened and uh, display that data in order to edit it so in order to do that we will uh, start by uh, uh, opening the designer and uh, create a new button uh, that will edit our data we're simply copying the, the one for delete and edit the caption like this edit selected here okay now we will add a new form the form that will take the data from our first form from the list box and in this new form we will add some controls for example three labels one two and three and it will be named like this the first one just a moment a line left good the first one it will be the id id then we will uh, have units and cost we will display only three columns from here we can display them all but it's not necessary units and cost great now uh, for the ID we will add also um, uh, a label because the ID will not be editable and uh, for the other fields we will have uh, two text boxes one two like this we'll put a background on the form And also for this in order to be transparent and then we'll add the button we can take the button easily here from here the save button from the where we take it from the first form and uh, this is how the the edit uh, form can look like now in order to um, show this form when uh, you click the button edit you simply go to the first form double click the button edit selected and uh, here we will say user form to that show we test it quickly and the form is visible now in order to transfer data <coughs> we go back in the uh, form one under the button edit selected and before uh, displaying the form we went, want to transfer some data for example we will transfer the ID and the units and the cost and in order to do that we will say like this user form to that label three that caption it will be our ID our ID it's like this the, the the ID of the selected item from the list box okay list box one that list list box one that list index so this from here is the ID of the selected item okay then we want to bring the cost also the units also which will be the same But it will be text box one that text and now we have to take the um, sixth and six and seven column so it will be list box one that column column five that list index List, no, list box one, list box one, that list index, 